I just just wanted to thank all the heroes that put their lives on the line to save mine. Um, forever in debt. I can't thank them enough. I just hope they know how much they mean to me. Also, I'd just like to thank all the cops and EMTs that um, that helped me out as well, getting me into the ambulance and to the hospital, and then from the hospital, life lighted here. Um, all the doctors and nurses that have been taking good care of me. I would like to meet all the all the people that that rescued me. I hope they'll hope hope I can soon. That's that's really all I wanted to say. Was just express my gratitude for those people. I was just watching the news and all of a sudden I see a I, a car on fire. And I recognized the car, and I just couldn't couldn't look away. I didn't want to watch it, but. I just couldn't look away, and then all of a sudden, you know, everyone swarms in and picks up the car, and then I see my my body, and I just look I look dead. And that's that's unreal to see yourself like that. I, I just was, oh my God, that's a miracle. I mean, that's quite a few people, but still, that's a lot of weight, and yeah, it's I don't know. Like I said, I don't think it's fully kicked in yet. I guess it just you know, says that, you know, good people come from everywhere. Um, like I said, I'm just really grateful for them, for them being there at the right time. I mean, how crazy is it that those three people from three different countries were were there for me when I needed them? I was going maybe three or four miles from my house, short ride, and I just wanted to make it quick and get it there and get back and... I didn't put it on, but yeah, I'm definitely a helmet advocate now.